Hello everyone, today we're taking a look at Mantas, a Windows peer-to-peer -peer worm that spreads over Grokster, Morpheus, LimeWire, Kazaa, and several other peer-to-peer -peer networks. So here we have a dummy Kazaa my shared folder location. It will drop a bunch of files here that are all copies of itself. And we have a bunch of files here that it will end up overwriting. We have a test word document. This is a test document. We have a test text document. It's going to be overwritten. We have a couple bitmaps on here, including my old pal Bubbles, the best background ever, HTML file, and finally a JPEG of a game that I'm a pretty big fan of. And I also have shared folders enabled on this virtual machine because it will drop a bunch of stuff there as it copies itself to every remote network drive it can find. It also tries to start overwriting stuff there too, so as soon as it runs I'm going to go ahead and turn off shared folders to prevent any additional data loss. So let's go ahead and run it. We run the worm and things pretty much immediately just die entirely. So now is the time to turn off shared folders. Okay we're good. So we can see we have some pretty interesting uh, file names here, especially the JPEGs. But then we have stuff like Doom 2 install, DivX, Flash, FXP crack, GTA 3 no CD crack, I like you.jpg. However, JPEG's no longer really open, because it tries to open Internet Explorer. It says setup is detected that you are running a version of Windows that already includes the updated files or enhancements you are attempting to install. So, I wasn't aware we needed to install JPEGs, you know. In fact, we just opened that other one just fine, and this also errors out. And I would show you what the bitmaps are overwritten with, but nothing happens when we run it. Internet Explorer in general is just kind of broken. Oh hey, it opened, but we can see the title at the top, and our cool HTML is gone, but it changes to aw, oh, that was really sweet, thank you, Matas. You also can't open Word, oh no, Word opens, Microsoft Word can't import, okay, it's broken. We can see it overwrote what was actually here with this preview that Word offers us, saying aw, oh, that was really sweet, thank you. Montas. So this adds it to the text documents, Word documents, and HTML files it can find and overwrites it with that. But we can see everything else that was here is pretty much gone. Oh, my old secret message is still here, so that's good. Generally, it only overwrites the first line of the documents that are overwritten. So it's not complete data loss, but still might be somewhat destructive. So on my host, since it dropped a bunch of files to my shared folder, I can actually show you what it overwrote all these bitmaps and JPEG files with because it dropped all the same files that you see here onto my shared folder. We drag it over, all of these images look exactly like this. Say I want you plus the heart. And that is it. It overwrites every image you can find on this computer with that. In fact my computer, when we open up and look at directories, now has this instead of the nice little HTML frame. We can see it dropped all the same stuff here in the root directory and something goes a little bit wrong here in the Windows directory because the worst part of this malware is that it overwrites every single executable it can find with itself. So FTP, 64 kilobytes. Font view, 64 kilobytes. IP config, 64K. Net DDE, 64. Telnet, 64 kilobytes. And every single one of these just runs a copy of the worm. And every single icon. It's also overwritten, so here's winupdate.ico. It's now the broken heart, because this, this worm just breaks your heart. Sorry, I couldn't resist saying that. So, now our computer's been entirely trashed. Nothing open. We can see the preview for the bitmap is now that heart. GIF files, bitmap, it's all preview, it's all broken. It's ruined forever. Your computer's screwed, and we'll go ahead and try to restart. But restarting doesn't even really work because it just exits back out to the desktop and you can still use your computer just fine. So the only thing you can really do is force restart. And of course, files are corrupted and don't run. So that's about it for your computer. And that is about it for the Montas Windows Worm. Thank you very much for watching. Take care.